Now let's look at risk analysis. Roughly speaking, risk analysis for a trader is a measure of how much the market can go against us. There are a few ways to calculate this. You should understand the range, which is the average distance or the price that an instrument can cover in a given period of time. This can be assessed using an indicator called ATR. Let's say a stock has an ATR of $10 on an hourly chart. What that means is that that stock can move $10 against you every hour. If the daily ATR of another stock is $10, that just means that that stock can move $10 against you every single day. We can use daily and hourly ATRs to understand our risk in terms of time horizons. This will help us find stocks that fit our risk appetite when it comes to daily and hourly time horizons. Another aspect of risk analysis would be volatility. This means how wild the moves are. The way I look at volatility is by looking at how big a run and a retrace is. If the retraces between all runs are quite small, we can confidently say that the move is very volatile. Another way of looking at volatility is comparing second and third standard deviation moves using VWAP bands or Bollinger bands. When the bandwidth of these volatility indicators expand, that means that the size of the moves could be bigger and can expand further and can move against you farther than you expect. When these bands are shrinking, that means then the volatility for that instrument is going down and you can expect smaller moves against you. Mm -hmm.